drinking too much coffee. You smoke too much. Look. Don't argue now, okay? I'm not arguing. This is a hospital. The honor is well. You can't smoke anywhere in hallways. This is like one of those moments you have in life. Yeah, okay. You? <laughs> Spend your entire childhood with a head up in the clubs. I was born. James, you're the eldest. And you found her. So? So the decision has been made up for you. You went against her wishes by calling the ambulance. You knew what she wanted. Look, you've done the same exact thing. You saw your mother help her. And did she? Did she not make her wishes expressed in those? Yes, but you were not there. Look, she was helpless, okay? You would have done the same. It's not what she wanted. Look, what I wanted was... It doesn't matter. Look, fact what I wanted was for me not to see our mother lying there Conscious, barely alive. She's my mother too. We can both prepare for this day. You were not there, James. Yeah, like that's gonna help. Well, I feel better. You know what the problem with you is, James? Every time responsibility hits you, you just cover your bloody head with a blanket and then just leave it just like that. Don't tell me that you're prepared for this day. Don't. Thank you. It's hardening to see how family bonds together in times of crisis. This, this, you have a good look. This is not a family. It's just you and I. We've done nothing to keep this family together. You know what? The only person that cares about this right now is my mom. Our mother and my support system waiting for one of the children to make an adult decision. Probably the only decision that we've ever made. Shout each other out. Okay. She's got an amazing life, hasn't she? Thank you.